Hello and welcome to another lesson that is part of the TI30 XB student course. In this lesson, we will be covering addition and subtraction of fractions, simple fractions, improper fractions and mixed numbers. The key button here is the fraction button here, N over D, and we use that to enter a simple fraction. Now in math print mode, Fractions involving the use of this key can include operation keys such as addition, multiplication, etc., and other function keys such as open bracket, percentage, etc. To enter fractions with operations in math print mode, we press the fraction button before entering a number. However, entering a number before pressing this fraction button causes that number to become the numerator. To move to the denominator, it's a simple case of pressing down arrow. Calculations using fractions can display fraction or decimal results depending upon the input. And the TI30XB defaults to improper fractions and results are automatically simplified. So let's see that with a, a first example. And what we're going to do is we're going to enter 15 on 30 and see what the calculator gives us. So we enter 15, we press the fraction key. We can then automatically enter 30 in the denominator box and press enter. And note that it is we have the simplified result that 15 on 30 is the same as one half. And these two fractions are known as equivalent fractions. Moving right along to our next example, we're now going to use the TI30XB to confirm that two thirds plus a quarter does not equal three over seven. So let's see how we perform that uh, calculation or demonstration. So we're going to enter two and press the fraction key. We're going to enter three in the denominator box. We're going to press arrow to the right now to move out of the denominator box and press the addition key. Then enter one, press the fraction key again, enter four in the denominator box and press enter. And what we see there is that two thirds plus a quarter actually equals 11 on 12. It does not equal three on seven. And we've confirmed that result. The two thirds plus a quarter does not equal three on seven. Okay, let's look at another example. And before we do this example, we're going to introduce two new functions. To convert between mixed numbers and simple fraction form, we press second and then multiply by 10 to the n. As you can see there, that's our conversion to mixed numbers. And if we want to enter a mixed number, we press second and then our fraction key. You can see above there, you've got a, a u n over d. So let's use those keys now in this example. And this example shows us how to express improper fractions as mixed numbers and vice versa. So our first example is we're going to use the TI30XB to convert the improper fraction 19 on 8 to a mixed number. So to do that, we're going to enter 19 and then we're going to press our fraction key. We're going to enter eight in the denominator box, press arrow to the right to move out of the denominator box. Now we're going to press second times 10 to the n, and that gives us our um, conversion to a mixed number uh, command. And then we're going to press enter. And what you'll see there is we've been able to demonstrate that the improper fraction 19 on eight is the same as the mixed number two and three eighths. Similarly, what we're going to do now is we're going to go in the opposite direction and we're going to convert the mixed number four and seven twelfths to an improper fraction. 
So what we do now is we're going to enter four. We're going to press second and then our fraction key. And now we've got our mixed number template. We enter seven in the numerator box, press arrow down and enter 12 in the denominator box and press enter. And note that our mixed number four and seven twelfths is the same as the improper fraction 55 on 12. Our final example for this lesson is we're now going to show you how to use the calculator to uh, add uh, fractions. And these include mixed numbers and fractions with unrelated denominators. So our final example is use the TI-30XB to calculate three quarters plus one and seven twelfths. And we're going to give our answer both as an improper fraction and as a mixed number. Okay, so uh, to do this, what we're going to do is we're going to uh, enter three, then press our fraction key, and then enter four in the denominator box. Press arrow to the right to move out of there. We're going to then enter, I'll press plus for, um, for addition. We're then going to enter one. We're going to press second and then our fraction key. So this brings up our mixed number template. We're going to enter seven in the numerator box. Arrow down to enter 12 in the denominator box and then press enter. And note that our answer comes out as the improper fraction seven thirds. Now to express this answer as a mixed number, what we can do now is we can press second times 10 to the N and press enter. And that converts that improper fraction seven thirds to the mixed number two and one thirds. So as an improper fraction, we have seven lots of one third. And as a mixed numeral, we have, or as a mixed number, we have two wholes and a third of a whole. Okay, that's it for this lesson. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye.